You mentioned EOS, Terry. Mm -hmm. What does EOS stand for? EOS is the uh, short for Entrepreneur Entrepreneurial Operating System. It was created by Gino Wickman, and he wrote a book called Traction. So if you would like to know more about that EOS oper or the operating system, just read the book Traction, and I, it's a great book. Uh, and all it, it, what he's done is he's combined and summarized quite a few long-term, very successful business concepts that most businesses understand. In other words, you may not learn very, very many new concepts, but it is the simplicity of the system itself and how it's been written up and the tools that are behind this system that really makes uh, a company tick and click. Let's pretend that I am a business owner and I've owned a company for 25 years and I've got somewhere between 10 and 15 employees. Mm -hmm. So I'm a fairly established small business. And for the first 20 years, it's been a good ride. We've done well and we've seen progress over those years. But the last five have been a little more difficult and I'm not seeing a forward momentum anymore like I used to. Where would you start with a company like mine? Results for Business starts every one of their companies uh, dealing with one issue and that one issue is what operating system are you working off of? What platform? Because what we see oftentimes in businesses when we walk in and we start taking we start to become familiar with how they run their business we're seeing that the right hand doesn't understand what the left hand is doing. We're seeing one leader not doing the not following the same systems that two other leaders on the executive team are following. We're we're seeing that the people underneath them that report up have been miscommunicated with or there's been a lack of communication. We need to get everyone on the same system speaking the same language. And again, as I said before, that is the EOS. We start everyone off on the EOS platform. They have to understand that there can only be one operating system. Uh, and I know a lot of managers in departments protect their own department and they come up with their own system because they truly believe and justify that their department, they know more about their department than anyone else. But when you have every department creating their own little tiny system, there is no operating system. Mm -hmm. There's multiple operating systems and that's where the problem lies. So we get the leadership team aligned and agreed upon they agree upon one operating system. Once that's agreed upon, my goodness, the momentum starts because everyone is following the same system. It creates more efficiency, better effectiveness, and a lot less miscommunication.